started you just touch the pedals and and you just smile. The biking revolution is here. That's according to the inventors of the Copenhagen wheel, the new wheel that makes any bike electric. Bicycles should feel like a bike. Exactly the same, just let people imagine that the road shrunk underneath them or that the hill flattened. Asaf Biederman is one of the inventors of the wheel with the pretty red center. It was developed in the Sensible City Lab at MIT and is now run by Biederman and his team at Super Pedestrian. The goal? Make cycling more appealing for commuters by giving them a wheel that transforms their bike as well as their route. We see a lot of people around the world looking for a replacement to the car. Something that's compelling, something that could be a competitive alternative. Once the wheel syncs with the owner's smartphone, the driver can switch between the different riding modes. The wheel also charges itself whenever the rider backpedals with what Biederman refers to as regenerative braking. All of this and the data it collects are managed by the three computers within the wheel which monitor its performance. Uh, we've given thousands and thousands of test rides. I don't remember many, maybe a handful, that didn't end with a smile from ear to ear. It's, and to me that's great because then it's not about utility, it's emotion. You capture some kind of moment of magic. It was amazing. Yeah, it, 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 was fun. it just It's like having a superpower, an extra kick. So, could the bikes of the future be adding a red wheel? Biederman thinks so. He says if you just change a few car trips a week to biking, you've already changed the world. All people need is the motivation and he thinks the Copenhagen wheel could be it. Reporting for BUTV, I'm Brittany Comack.